thirteen, Donny sentence. Synopsis: As Donny is sentenced for his family's misgivings, Donny pleads for mercy, noting how he had never been a part of his family's tyranny. However, intoxicated by revenge, the revolution cares for not, and treats every bourgeois token as a sign of corruption. The song adds a satirical touch. Scene: The same courtroom. As Darnie is being sentenced, the focus shifts from a somber plea from Darnie, interspersed with farcical comments from commoners, revealing the ignorant view of a revolution that is just thirsting for blood, not justice. Charles Darnie, the defendant, stands for you. I know that. A noble and every month, un sangla ignoble rat. He's a French Bourbon aristocrat, a traitor in hiding that was his tradecraft. Kentucky, Bourbon in France, oh crikey, what a shame! Not the whiskey, you idiot. Just the Tennessee by name, Citizen Louis Carpe of France regime. He was Charles sixteen. Now he's screwed up his dream. Ashamed, I am of being a nev, Raymond, a name so detested, a name I wasn't fond. So I shed my station and family name, left for England as a Donny in spite and shame. Detesting the high, said my uncle. Well, it's not to blow. Involuntary it is, but an homage by the low. At one at never said if it's bread they can't bake. Don't whine about hunger. Why not eat cake? What not a bread, but a cake. What a massive mistake. Antoinette should have known. Cake causes tummy ache. Good grief, you git! It's yarny you miss. It's the stain of nobles that solely remiss. But if you still don't get it, you're a mental lame duck, with more clods like you. First republics out of luck. So comes the sentence. Donny's head will roll. How could heartache, reign of terror, none will ever grow old?